Hello, Drax the Swipe and all things Geek viewers. Just Kevin Coriel coming at you again to show you another unboxing of some cool geek stuff. Um, I told you before how Geek Fuel had not accepted our payments or said that they couldn't accept it and then sent us stuff anyway. Well, right after we got that box, my wife went on and canceled Geek Fuel. Or so she thought. Now it's saying inactive, but I'm not sure because right after she canceled things, the next month, we have Geek Fuel again. So this is the April box. As of the taping of this, you have about one and a half days to get in on this April box. So, we're going to go and do an opening here. Show you what's in this box and let you know where you can get this. So, April box is supposed to have a theme of Doctor Who, Star Wars, The Force Awakens, and Civil War, I believe it was. So we're going to see what all's in here. First up on the top, we have a Doctor Who, 10th Doctor Adventures, Year 2. This is um, a variant cover, number 2.1. So you've got Doctor Who variant cover. Comes with a certificate of authenticity of the variant cover's um, artwork. It says, um, Geek Fuel has issued this certificate to authenticate this copy of Doctor Who, the 10th Doctor Year 2 Number 1 as an exclusive limited edition distributed solely by Geek Fuel. So unless you get Geek Fuel, you will not be seeing this cover. Unless someone turns it into your local comic book store. Now, what else do we have in here? We have a sticker, Smile Makers. Here's your Civil War stuff, it looks like, or at least the first part of it. Captain America's shield, you know what? I'll probably end up putting it right here. Go Team Cap. Now, here we have, I mentioned it before, you have Fallen A2P Protocol. This is your Steam game for the box. As I said with Dinoside and for the one that came before Dinoside, I will sell these for half off. This one says $20 value. Therefore, for $10, if anyone wants, you can get Fallen A2P Protocol's stream key, which is here on the back. I hope I didn't flash it to you earlier. Otherwise, you could probably get it for free. Um, <laughs> no, I'll make sure you can't see it. Anyway, $10. If anyone's interested, Hit me up on Instagram, Facebook, DraxusWeb at gmail.com. First come, first serve, you will get the code. Any money that is made for this, which $10 unless you want to donate more, will go to Extra Life, a group that works with the Children's Miracle Network and gives them any money raised to help sick kids and Basically, any money you can help with for donating to Extra Life goes right to helping sick kids. You can help save a life with this stuff. So, think about that. Your gaming can help save a life. Now, you also get a t-shirt. Which, in this case, this is your Civil War thing. That's a lot better than just a sticker. You have a Rock'em Sock'em Robots look for Captain America and Iron Man. So a cool little t-shirt. I will definitely be wearing that one. Now let's see what else is in here. Okay, as usual, you have the Geek Fuel magazine. As I said in the other video, it touches on a lot of subjects, on especially things that are in the box. has a couple of other things, but if you're looking for like a full in-depth magazine sort of thing, this isn't it. It's got a lot of small useless things, general knowledge things. 
it's very brief, so don't look for anything in depth here. Now, here's the fun things. Doctor travels through art history. Who remembers the Doctor Who Vincent Van Gogh storyline? Well, if you remember that, you'll remember pictures of the TARDIS that Van Gogh had and that were hidden in Van Gogh's pictures and a lot of Doctor Who things. So here we have a four coaster set, which they're kind of stuck together here. I have Starry Night with the TARDIS in it. Um, some Asian painting with the TARDIS in it. So it's not just from the Van Gogh one. Even though that was the first one I had pulled out, which made me think they may have all been the same. Um, not quite sure on this one. Pretty cool looking. It says Phillies on there, so I'm assuming it's from a Philadelphia thing, which is cool with me since I was born there. Looks almost Norman Rockwell-ish, which would be even cooler since I'm related to Norman Rockwell. And last but not least, your typical farmer and his wife picture, bless the TARDIS. I've got a cool little set of coasters there. And then last but not least... We have a Funko Pop. Now, I guess this isn't the Funko Pop series, but it is a Funko Bobblehead, Vinyl Bobblehead. I'm pretty sure it's Funko. Yeah, Funko. So, I'm going to tell you a little bit about this before I go, because this was the last thing in the box. If you like the Pop vinyls, the fabrications... The bobbleheads like this, I have a wonderful place for you to go. I'm going to put the link in the comments section. Follow that link and you can get 20% off buying your first pop from them. It's a place called Pop in the Box. Now here's a great thing. You get 20% off, but if you buy from them, I get a little bit of um payback too if i sell four of them through here i get a mystery pop which will be going to my son so if you want to make a three-year-old happy go and um buy some pops they're really cool they're very collectible a lot of them are bobbleheads so like that one um let me show you one other This is one of my favorites here. We got a little Cthulhu pop. This is not the bobblehead variety, so you'll have bobbleheads, you'll have ones like this. You'll have giant pops. I have a basically full size TARDIS compared to the other pops. I've got a Fourth Doctor, I've got K9, you've got Star Wars, Disney, Frozen, you've got WWE wrestlers. Musicians, TV, movies. Basically, if it's out there, Funko has most likely made a pop about it. Um, Adventure Time. <laughs> Comic books, Marvel and DC, Star Wars, Star Trek. It's out there. They've done it. Um, Sailor Moon is coming out on it. So if you like that sort of thing... They all have that sort of squarish head. Yeah, this one's the got big head, small body. They're all big head, small body. A lot of them are bobble heads. If you like that sort of thing, like I said, they're very collectible. There's certain things that only come in certain boxes out there. There are ones that only go to certain stores. Pop in the box gets them all. And the cool thing about it is, Pop in the Box will send you a mystery one each month for only 10 bucks. That's what you'll be paying in the store for them is 10 bucks. However, here's the cool thing. Pop in the Box is send you, sending you a mystery pop. 
you can sign up for one, two, three, four. The more you sign up for, the cheaper it gets. You go through my link, you get 20% off of your initial order, your first order with them. So that's cool right there. You can not only get the mysteries, you can go and purchase specific ones from them. Like they might have some from the San Diego Comic Con left over and say you want one of those. You can purchase it direct through them. I'm pretty sure this is Funko that's doing this. Um, the other really cool thing, they have an online list of every pop Funko made. The orbs, the small vinyls, the fabrications, the vehicles for the orbs, um, the pops, the pop bobbleheads, you name it, if Funko makes it, it shows up on their website. You can click what you have in your collection already on the website. That way, the mystery box will never be a duplicate. The other really cool thing is if you go through the listings of everything they have, which let me tell you can take forever, and you thumb up certain ones, whatever you thumb up will be what you would most likely get in the mystery boxes first. If you then don't thumb up something, that would be like your second tier. And if you thumb down something, they will not send it to you. So if you don't like Sailor Moon, you just thumb down them. You won't get Sailor Moon. So it's really cool. Like I said, if four of you buy them, my son will be getting a free one. So we'll put that link down at the bottom. You also get 20% off. 20% off. That's a cool thing. So check back with us. I'll be um, talking about some more boxes in just a little while. And telling you about more Funko products. Because the Marvel Collector's Core is all Funko. Funko does the box. It does the shirt. It does everything in the box. It's really cool. And also, just so you know, if you want to help support us and what we do, I am the author of this book. It was The Zombie Attack Before Christmas. If you know anyone who likes zombies, this is a great book. It's it was The Night Before Christmas, retold as a zombie story. And not just that, but it's fully illustrated. So if you're interested in this, you can either get Amazon.com, um, you can get it as an ebook at Amazon, a print book at Amazon. If you go to Smash Words, you can get it as an ebook. But if you go to DraxisWeb slash DWP, DraxisWeb.com slash DWP, that's our website, you can get this directly through me, cheaper than Amazon. And I will sign a copy for whoever you want. So this could be a great Halloween present, a great Christmas present, birthday present, whatever, for the zombie lover in your family. And that'll help bust out that any money from these sales goes directly to helping my cancer treatment payments. So there you go. There's another unboxing video. I will be back with another one shortly with Marvel Collector's Core this time.